A very good morning children. Today we are continuing with the chapter number 4 that is operating system. In the previous video we have done the various components like changing the position of taskbar, notification area and so on. Now we will solve the true false related to that components. The first one is an operating system is also known as OS. Yes, this is true. Second is the start menu is divided into two parts. Yes, that's already two. And the last third one is show desktop button is present at the rightmost corner of the taskbar. That's also true. And the last one is Steve Jobs is the founder of Microsoft Corporation. That is false because the founder of Microsoft Corporation is Bill Gates. The next topic is selecting and deselecting icons. To select an icon, click on it. The icon will be highlighted. To deselect an icon, click anywhere away from the icon. The icon will not be highlighted anymore. So, this means the icon is deselected. Here you can see in the figure number 4.5 in the part A, computer icon is highlighted. It means it is selected. In part B, it is unselected. It means it is deselected. Next one is selecting adjacent icon. Adjacent means which are closer to each other. To select adjacent icons, follow these steps. Step 1 is left click to select the first icon. Step 2. Press and hold down the shift key. Click on the last icon to be selected. The third one is release the shift key and mouse. All the adjacent icons will be selected here shown in the figure number 4.6. Next one is selecting non-adjacent icons. Non-adjacent icons means which are not closer to each other means selecting the icons randomly. To select non-adjacent icons follow these steps. Number one is press and hold down the control key. Click on the icons to be selected one by one. And last is release the control key and mouse. In this way you can select the non-adjacent icons. Next topic is opening an application to open an application or a program follow these steps number one place the pointer on the icons of a program double click on it and the last is the application opens on the screen there's an info box on your book in computers an application is typed of a program or software that allows you to perform specific task next topic is arranging desktop icons Arranging desktop icons means you can change the place of the icons. Arranging desktop icons makes it easy to locate any file or program quickly on the desktop. To arrange the desktop icons, follow these steps. First is, right click anywhere on the blank area of the desktop. Next one, a shortcut menu appears. Bring the pointer on the view option. The last one is, Click on the Auto Arrange Icons option from the sub menu. Here you can see all the steps in the figure 4.8. So, children, in this video you have learned so many things. Watch this video carefully and stay home, stay safe. Thank you.